Question 20, part A, factorise x squared minus 12x plus 27. So we're looking at 27, and we're looking for um, factors that will give us minus 12. So 1 and 27, and it's 3 and 9. Now with a plus at the end, and a minus in the middle, that will only come if you have a double minus inside. So we're going to have x minus 3 times x minus 9. Now, if um, that same expression is set equal to 0, we can use the factorised form to find the solutions. So we know then that x squared minus 12x plus 27 can be written as x minus 3 times x minus 9. It's now equal to 0. So either x will equal 3, that would make the first bracket become 0, and anything times 0 is naught. Or we can use the second factor, it would be 9, from x minus 9. So those are your two solutions. Now, the last part, if you can remember that this is the difference between two squares, and you're looking at y plus 10 times y minus 10, then you factorise that. This is the sort of a squared minus b squared type, which always comes out as a plus b, a minus b. So you can see my a is y and my b is 10. So the answer is y plus 10, y minus uh, 10. This is just to explain. So that's your answers there, there and there for four marks.